my name is Rebecca Grace and I am the CEO of Rebecca Grace Designs. Today we're going to be talking about the tag list in your blog, specifically in Squarespace 7.1. So I'm going to click over to the blog on this site, which is called News, and go to a blog post. And you'll see at the bottom it has a list of tags that I've used for this post. Um, obviously when you're doing tags for your post you're going to be using some keywords um, that other people might be using to search for the information in your post. This is a great way to help boost your search engine optimization or in other words to get these posts ranked in searches and search engines like in Google. So you want to apply lots of different tags on your blog pages. However, you might not want those tag pages displayed at the bottom, especially if you're using a whole bunch of tags on your post. You don't want this list of random words um, shown on the bottom of your blog post. But if we click over to edit our post and click on the pencil icon, you'll notice that you can show or hide categories. You can show or hide the date, the author's name, the author profile but they don't have an option in here in order to hide the tag pages. So in that case, we're going to have to use custom CSS in order to hide the tag pages. So what you're going to do is go over to design custom CSS, and we're going to add some CSS to hide tag pages. So I'm going to hover over top my tag list, right click and select inspect, and I'm looking for a class name that applies to this entire list. So if I hover over top of this, you'll see it's just highlighting tag four, and I'm gonna keep scrolling up until the whole list is highlighted. You notice if I go up even higher, I'm now no longer highlighting the tags. So this is the line I want. I'm not gonna use blog meta item because I have a feeling there's other meta items and that might apply to other areas of my site and I don't wanna apply this code to anywhere but the tags. So this blog meta item tags seems like it'll be a good fit. So I'm going to copy this class name. Since it's a class, we use a period in front and then we use open and closing curly brackets and the property we're going to use in CSS is display, and we're gonna use a value of none. And you'll see that my tags have disappeared. If yours are not disappearing for some reason, you can use um, exclamation point important, and it should hide them then, but we don't want to use this exclamation point important unless we absolutely have to. Okay, so if it hides with just display that none, then leave it at that. You're going to click save. And you have now hidden your tags on all of your blog posts in Squarespace 7.1. So if you like this tutorial and you wanna be notified when other tutorials are out, make sure you click subscribe and the little bell beside it. If you're watching this on my blog, then make sure to sign up for the freebie in the footer so that you can be notified when another tutorial has been posted. Until then, that is how you hide the tags on blog pages in Squarespace 7.1.